Hey everybody, it's Joe Doom back for another video, and today is going to be Harry Potter specific related. And I was online and I saw that Starbucks had a Harry Potter butterbeer secret menu type thing, so I said, hey, I want to try that. So I got the latte and the frappuccino, uh, frappuccino version. And when I was driving around, there was a brand new candy store that just opened up, and they had the Harry Bot uh, Potter Potter. Yeah, I cannot speak today. They had the Harry Potter Berry Bots Every Flavor Beans, and they also had this, which they say is just like butter beer that you can buy at like theme parks and stuff. So I'm gonna give all of these a try, and I think what I'm gonna do is go from tallest the smallest so that way this I can get an idea of what butterbeer actually tastes like and then just go down the line with the cold and then the hot and then possibly disgusting here we go Ooh, nice butterscotch smell to it I love butterscotch so here we go mmm I love butterscotch and that is really good. I don't know if this is exactly what butterbeer tastes like, but I'm going to assume yes, just because I have no idea. So that's the butterbeer original. It's not super chilled or anything. It was chilled in the car on the way here with the nice cool temperatures. Not bad. Moving on to the Starbucks frappuccino version of the butter beer that doesn't taste anything like that but it is very good maybe i have to stir in the whipped cream i don't think that would make any difference all right let's try it again definitely doesn't taste like butter beer or at least that but it's still really really good and supposedly this is, if you want to just order, it's a vanilla bean cream frappuccino, caramel syrup, toffee nut syrup, and caramel drizzle. And this is the same thing, but in latte form. Moving on to the latte. Oh, it smells so good. All right, here we go. Well, I can't really taste anything other than it's a... Uh, a latte. <laughs> I honestly cannot tell the difference between any of the lattes because I don't drink them that often and when I do they generally taste the same. This does not taste like this and these do not taste like this so far but that's not gonna change so verdict as far as coffee goes the Starbucks Harry Potter drinks do not taste like butterbeer in my opinion. Okay with the drinks out of the way now I can get down to the Berry Bots Every Flavor Bean. And I'm kind of terrified because I've heard stories that some of these taste really, really, really bad. Oh. <laughs> I'm just looking at some of the flavors. We got banana, black pepper, blueberry, booger, candy floss, Cherry, cinnamon, ugh. dirt, earthworm, earwax, grass, green apple, marshmallow, rotten egg, sausage, that's interesting, lemon, soap, tutti frutti, vomit, and watermelon. <sighs> well, I guess I'm going to try one of every single flavor. Ah, uh, runaway beans! I have them all here on the table. You can't really see it. There you go. I'm just going to pick and grab and see what happens. Let's see here. I think this one is a banana. I'm not sure. That is good. I'm going to try to pick out the bad ones now so I can at least have something. I'm going to save this other banana for the end. Okay, let's see what I got here. There's a pink one. Let's see, this this one should be candy floss. That kind of tastes like a candy version of dental floss. Huh, okay. 
I think this light green one is supposed to be grass, so let's find out. I've never eaten grass, so I can't tell you what that is like. But <clears throat> the taste of it kind of tastes like the smell of when you, like, pull apart leaves or whatever. So it's got that kind of greeny kind of flavor, I guess. So that's that. Okay, let's go with this one. I can't tell if this is earwax or rotten egg. So I guess we'll just uh, find out. I don't really know what that was. I couldn't really taste a distinct flavor. I think these are green apples, so I'm going to set those aside for last. That one, I believe, is a watermelon, so I'll save that for last. This looks like a Tutti Frutti, so I'll save that for later. I don't know what this one is. It doesn't have a category for this one. So I guess we'll just find out. Oh, this is the color. But it doesn't say what it is on the box. That was lemon, but it was not what it looked like. Now I'm confused, because there's a lot of ones that are kind of not on here. These two I know are cherry. I guess we'll start getting into the bad ones now. I think this one is earthworm. <laughs> so, it doesn't smell like anything, but. Oh! <laughs> that is nasty! Oh! Jeez! Ah, the coffee almost made it worse. Oh. Now I'm afraid for the other ones. I thought they weren't going to be so bad. <laughs> All right, I tried those. Go away. <laughs> oh, I think I'll save that one for last. Supposedly, this one is a booger. We'll find out. I still have the earthworm in my mouth. <laughs> It kind of tasted similar to the earthworm. They probably put this really bad flavor in all the ones that are supposed to be bad and weird and stuff, and then just kind of added other stuff. I must have the willpower to continue. <laughs> this one is soap. I don't know why I keep smelling it. There's not going to be a smell. Oh, there it is. There is the soap. Ugh. That's bad. All right, give me something different, like, uh, what is this? I think, I think this one is sausage. Nope, I think that one was dirt. Ugh. <laughs> Ooh. All right, this one should be sausage. Nope, that was dirt, too. Ah. Okay. I've only got a couple more flavors left, thankfully. <laughs> I've got two mystery flavors that I can't find on the box. Uh, black pepper and vomit. I'm going to make sure I do vomit last. So, I need more coffee. I can't get that taste out of my mouth. This one, I don't know. So we're just going to go with it. That was a nice change of pace. <laughs> It was a miscolored banana one. Oh, that could have saved my palate. <laughs> okay, I don't know what this one is. So here we go. Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not going to eat it tomorrow. Yeah. Oh, that was terrible. Oh. I think that was the rotten egg. Oh, black pepper. I like black pepper. Let's just see what it's like in a jelly bean. Oh, I'm surprised. That's actually kind of nice compared to everything else I've tried. That is is su pleasantly <laughs> What was I trying to say? Surprisingly and pleasantly nice. 
Uh, okay, I know that you're waiting for me to do this one. I absolutely know you're waiting for me to do this one. The vomit one. I am going to do it. But first, let me drink some coffee. <laughs> as much as I like the black pepper one, I gotta get rid of the flavor. Okay. Vomit flavored berry bots. Every flavor bean. So bad. Okay. <laughs> Nasty. Give me some of this. It's not helping. We got all the bad ones out of the way. Oh, that was bad. I must like you all a lot to do that. Oh my gosh. Okay, <clears throat> so the ones we haven't tried yet, I believe this one is lemon, which is this one. I have tried a lemon by accident because it was miscolored. Oh, uh, come here. Mm-hmm. That's really good. Oh, man. These two look so identical. One of them's either cherry or cinnamon or I don't know. I hope they're both cherry because as much as I don't like cherry, I'd rather have cherry than cinnamon. Okay. Cherry. Not cinnamon. All right. Next red one. Cinnamon. <laughs> Blah. I hate cinnamon. All right. Got a, I don't know if you can see that, a tutti fruity. Not bad. This is a green apple, I hope. Mm-hmm. Very greeny and apple-y. <laughs> Got watermelon. Now, with Jelly Bellies, I there was a very hard time distinguishing between watermelon and jalapeno when I was a kid. That was not a fun surprise. <laughs> I tell you that, but... All right, this one says it's watermelon. We'll go with that. Mm-hmm. That's good. And the best for last, another banana. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video, taste testing this variety of Hogwarts Harry Potter related stuff. You got the butterbeer, supposedly, drink. You got the Starbucks Harry Potter themed frappuccino and lattes. And the Berry Bots Every Flavor Beans. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time.